What is up, you baggies? Dan Barnett here. Uh, 2nd of January, 2022. Wow, what a 24 hours to be a baggy, eh? Incredible, incredible. Uh, some highs, some very lows. Um, first of all, let's talk about Daryl DK. Um, obviously, he was rumoured to be coming in late yesterday afternoon on a loan with a view to buy if we get promoted ended up being a permanent deal uh, nine and a half million rumored fee um did not see that coming whatsoever um 21 years old 31 goals in 67 games bags potential um something that was sorely needed um in the side and and then <laughs> then there's today's game against Cardiff 1-1 one, one. Um, first of all on stats we are on paper we are the stats look very good for us um, 30 shots but only three on target 54% possession in the game but the first half, for example, very embarrassing for me. I'm uh, pretty sure it was for you too. Uh, complete mess from back to front. No quality at all. Um, far too many times this season, I've spoke to people who agree and they say, if the opposition was of any quality, as it might be in the Premier League, we would be ripped to shreds. But I feel like that every single game at the moment. Um, you know, it shows the quality of the league at the moment. Um, that teams can't score against us, but we cannot score against them either. And today, towards the end of the first half, a, a, another poor defensive display led to conceding a silly goal um, and like, I think it was only lucky that only one made it in to be fair um, the second half very lucky to get a quick goal that was let's face it it was offside if it was in the Premier League it would have been ruled out with VAR and to be fair, we got to, we've got to take it where we can get it at the moment. Um, that's just the luck that we've uh, got at the moment. Um, I think, bar the stupid tackle from Moet and the subsequent red card, I think we was mildly better, but still nothing of substance going forward. And I feel like we... Um, let Cardiff in way too many times, getting too many opportunities that, as I said, teams of quality would would snap up. Um, towards the end of the game, well, at the end of the game, um, what everyone would agree is a stonewall penalty. The referee blows for full time shocking um and then that quite frankly incited a riot uh ishmael stomped onto the pitch had to be restrained by jake livermore i think he may have ripped that referee's head off if he got hold of him to be perfectly honest um and that obviously led to sam being sent off as well but at the end of the day, um, I think it obviously wasn't the referee, the poor refereeing that cost us the game. It was just that poor quality as per usual. Um, it's very worrying at the moment as I'm looking at the table with, within A couple of games, we could be we could 
we could end up out of the playoff places. I think that's very, very worrying. And even though we've got our man in DK, I think there's so much more work to be done. Um, you know, we hear that Val is a stat man. Well, I wonder where he, how he feels about these stats. Last 11 games, five red cards, six goals scored, only three wins. It does not look good at all. Next up, we've got Brighton on Saturday in the FA Cup. I personally not interested. I think we've got bigger fish to fry at the moment. We've got to salvage this season by staying in the playoff places, to be perfectly honest. Every season, we, we talk of a good cup run, how lovely that would be. Obviously, it would be brilliant. But every season is the same at the moment. We are just trying to salvage the season, trying to stay off the playoff places and... Yeah, I think we can we can just forget about that, to be perfectly honest. One change that will have to be made, obviously. Um, in gold, Sam Johnson, showing a red card today. In my honest opinion, I think it should be the last time we see him in an Albion shirt. Um, I think it's the perfect time now to move him on, make a quick deal, get a little bit of money for him and just move on, to be perfectly honest. Um, I wouldn't want to hazard a guess as to why he's not been as, as good as he was last season. Um, but we can't deny he's been nowhere near as good. We can only think that it might be to do with wanting to move away. So, I, I, I think we, we are well equipped in the goalkeeper department to, you know, invest elsewhere, to be perfectly honest. Anyway, if you've uh, got this far, cheers for watching. Much appreciated. Uh, till next time, come on you baggies.